Alright, welcome back to WWE 2K19, my career mode. So, last time it looks like we were going to be getting the help of Matt Hardy. I'm not even sure how he's going to help us. I, I don't know. Anyway, let's talk to Kurt Angle first. I thought a steel cage match was the best possible solution to settle the issues between you and Bray Wyatt. But obviously I was wrong. So I've decided that at the Royal Rumble, you and Finn Balor would take on Bray Wyatt and Cole Quinn in an Extreme Rules match. Alright, cool. Wait, Kurt... Kurt Angle side match? What? Do not express worry. I have made many successful jaunts to the most diverse. If you don't mind me asking, where exactly is it? Or when exactly is it? This isn't making me any less worried. The seven deities have deemed that the multiverse cannot <clears throat> be found on a map or in a calendar. Instead, it's all around us, all the time. Don't you remember from your last journey? No, different vessel, remember? Ah, oh, yes. On your previous visit, I believe your spirit was held in the vessel of an ostrich. What? Such a fantastic pheasant. Okay. He's totally weird. <laughs> no. I actually have seen, like, Matt Hardy's, like, broken or woken gimmick and Impact Wrestling and also WWE. So, yeah, let's talk to Finn Balor. You really think Matt Hardy can help me? Since he's become woken, he's clearly accessed some hidden away dark places, which is exactly what you need to do if we're going to defeat Bray and rescue your friend. I just noticed he's talking now instead of just saying like, hey, or something. I'm kind of afraid to see where Matt will take me. That's good. You can harness your fear to fuel your inner demon. Man, sometimes I miss the days when the scariest thing I had to do was dress up like the Miz. Alright, so I guess we're going to the multiverse. Welcome to the multiverse. It's delightful, isn't it? This is amazing. There is even more to see if you open your mind and look to the cosmos. <laughs> That's kind of cool. You will cool. encounter the various vessels that we have existed in. Ah, yes. Vanguard One. I was once a great Egyptian pharaoh in Giza. That's that little drone that, that was flying around. Met its demise from the bite of that wicked asp. Do you remember, brother Buzz? You roamed about Antarctica centuries ago. Was I some kind of explorer? No, you were a polar bear. Oh, let me guess. I was a shark too. No, your vessel was eaten by a shark off the coast of Australia in the 1940s. How gruesome. What's that? I think it's the Blade of Baron. Good match, Van Gogh. It seems as if we've slipped into the current dimension. I am truly happy for you. I don't want to be here. Big things are happening for us. He is a soul most tortured who has lived many conflicted existences. Wakey, wakey. wakey. I said I don't want to be here. Make it stop. You must Would face you your fears to, to find your inner demon, brother Buzz. I warned you not to get on Triple H's bat. 
Alright, well that was weird. So yeah, I get to pick a alter ego, it seems like. So Arctic Behemoth, Megalodon, King Cobra, or the Deceiver. That honestly kinda looks like Finn Balor. Like so much. I think I'm gonna go with that one. Kind of looks cool. Yes, you are now ready to delete the consumer of terrestrial entities. Yes. Hey. Where have you been? I've been looking all over for you. Bzzz. Wake up. I'm talking to you. Finn? Where have you been? I was in the multiverse with Matt Hardy finding my inner demon, just like you suggested. You've been gone for weeks. Weeks? Welcome back, Brother Buzz. I neglected to mention that the multiverse creates rifts in the Earth's time spectrum. What felt like 30 mortal minutes was indeed many weeks. Oh, God. But it was well worth it in your effort to make the vile Bray Wyatt obsolete. Weeks. You're probably a little out of sorts right now, but our big tag match versus Bray Wyatt and Cole is tonight. So you need to get your head on straight if we're going to defeat them and have any chance of helping Cole get out from under Bray's control. Don't worry, okay? I may have been gone for much longer than expected, but I found what I was looking for. And you'll be seeing it tonight. Weeks. Get ready to feel the buzz! It's buzz! I don't know. Should I skip this? I think I will, honestly. This is cool. The following contest is an extreme rules match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 360 pounds, the Rose and the Demon King, Finn Balor. Letters for whining 
taking shortcuts and failing upwards. That was honestly kind of cool. Wait, whoa, what the heck? Why is my character bald? Did anyone else see that? This match is sure to not disappoint, especially considering who's involved here tonight. You're absolutely right, Michael. This match will be one we'll be talking about for a long time to come. All right, well, we can honestly skip this. Yeah, why am I bold? Between Buzz That's and weird. The last few months, it's come down to this. An Extreme Rules tag match, where these four men are going to use everything at their disposal to tear each other apart. Let's not forget this fight, Buzz's animosity for Bray Wyatt. He still wants to help Bray's partner, Cole Quinn. That has to have an impact on Buzz's So, this is Extreme Rules, right? Well, put that aside tonight, because if he doesn't, he'll never be able to beat Bray Wyatt, and Cole Quinn will be gone forever. I think he can. This is a side of Buzz like we've never seen before. This might be it! Oh my! Phone vibrates when I'm recording something. Oh boy, he is rolling. <laughs> Drop down, leap frog. You've got to believe this one's over. What a stop. Good grief. He'd be smart to stay put there. His shoulders are down. Oh, impact. Will Buzz be able to continue? I doubt it. Ray Wyatt's just getting overwhelmed. It's gonna take more than that. And Finn Balor slips out of Buzz's way. Extraordinary elusivity. The Irishman has his Irish up. He wants to do this in the ring. Oh, and he reverses it. Oh, that's the impact. Why are the little monitor things on the table, like, glitched or something? Got it. 
My left sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. He wants no part of the outside. Irish whip. I wanted to break him through the table. Here it comes. Oh, almost through the turnbuckle. There is no coming back from that one. Finn Balor perched on top. Here it comes. Cody Gross. But he's got to capitalize. Shoulders on the mat. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. And Finn Balor is larger than life out there. Nailed it. Whoa, down he goes. That was impressive. He's got the shoulders down. This battle's not over yet. Boy, a two count there. Do you really think that was enough to take out a Wyatt? Well, Nelson. Rock hit. Got to keep your eyes peeled in matches like this. It's so tough to keep up with everything going on. Got it. My left sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Drop kick! Great athleticism. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Beautiful technique. Set it up. Up and down. This is all but over. Nobody gets up from that, Cole. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. He knows he's in trouble. Here he goes. Lights out. DDT connects. Here's his moment, Michael. The end may be near, folks. The opposition certainly has his number here in this Tornado Tag Team match. For a while there, it looked like he was going to take this match. It's amazing how quickly things can change here in the WWE. He's lining him up. He's looking shaky. This could be the end. Putting it all on the line. Why does the character do that? Like when I try that to way. run and kind of like shakes. Oh boy, he is rolling. should do it, Cole. There's no coming back from a slam of that magnitude. There it is. 1916. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Dropped like a bad habit. Lands this and he is done. Kick out, and he almost had him. Wow, I am impressed. Larian. He wants no part of the outside. Harsh impact. Oh, his feet are on the ropes. His feet are on the ropes. I expected as much from him tonight. Oh, nasty impact. He's got him down. This is it. Two. Three. There we go. Yes. We won. Unreal performance. Now, can I have my hair back? That's so weird. He did it. It took channeling his inner demon to walk alongside the demon king, Finn Balor. But Buzz is finally defeated Bray Wyatt.
but where does Cole Quinn stand in all of this now? It's over now, Cole. Fred never cared about you, but I do. Come with me. Everything will be okay. I'm sorry, Buzz. I don't know what happened. It's okay. It's all over. This is bigger than revenge. Buzz has seemingly rescued his friend Cole Quinn from Bray Wyatt's control. Finn Balor doesn't just throw that gesture around anyone. It's reminiscent of what we saw between Buzz and AJ Styles in Japan. But what does it mean? It means that Finn Balor and Buzz have formed a bond that won't soon be broken. All right. So, Chapter 11 is done. All right, so four messages. So what you did for Cole. Hope he's okay from here on out. Nice to know he's got you looking out for him. No idea what happened last few weeks. Feel like it was a bad dream. Thanks for helping me get rid of Bray. You are a true friend. And a message from Bailey. You finally beat Bray. And your demon look was so cool. Good job, Buzz. Finn Balor. Think we proved we make quite the team. Look forward to doing it again sometime. Welcome to the club. Alright guys, well I think I'm going to end the episode here. So hopefully you enjoyed and I will see you all next time.